Welcome to the only Last Jedi teaser trailer you need to watch, because I'm taking it from three different angles. A normal reactor, an over-the-top annoying reactor, and the cynical jaded Star Wars fan reactor. Let's give this a go. I am so excited for this. I am the biggest Star Wars nerd. I'm dead, and I haven't even watched yet. I am dead. Okay, here we go. Hello. Let's get this over with. J.J. Abrams has already ruined the franchise, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> yep. Oh, my God. Empire Strikes Back confirmed. It's oh just my, the same oh movie God. again. Unbelievable. Very pretty. I, mean, oh, I knew they were going to do this, too. Right. Was... <sighs> yeah, why wouldn't it be? If they're going to sink a, a ton yep. of money into this film. Dark and gritty. <sighs> Oh my gosh, I wonder if this is related to, oh, I don't even it's gonna, gonna, it's gonna right all be about talk. Mary that Sue Ray and her perfectness and how she can't do anything wrong. She knows how to fly a Millennium Falcon with no training. She knows how to use a lightsaber with no training. She knows how to use the force <laughs> oh, and mind what? control with <laughs> okay. no training. Yep. Sweet. Yep. It's so stupid. Star Wars used to be such a smart, Showtime. intelligent film with you know, brilliant fight choreography and acting and um, this, uh, the, what JJ's done with the franchise is he's, he's just spit in the name of the originals. They, they were, they were very serious grounded films. Oh, well, pod racing's in this too. Great. The Ewoks, very serious films. <laughs> That's stupid. It's so impractical. That lightsaber is so impractical in Star Wars, where everything else is very practical. It just stands oh. out. Yes. Yeah, this is just em yes. it's just Empire again. Yeah, that's all it is. I mean, I'm gonna go to it like four times and probably buy it 4K Blu-ray. It does. It looks great. It's Screw a good teaser franchise. trailer. It gives very little away. A lot of At least questions. the prequels try, were different. red you know? herrings. I think that final shot were... I don't even literally know if that's the best. It's a controversial statement. It's kind of hard to not tell. Really if it is, else, I think that will have 13 more videos out about this today on YouTube. Where, uh, Check me out. Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Or doubting that makes it path really I love this. I love everything. It's the best movie ever made. the ugliness that's come from being a Jedi. Constantly battling with the dark side. But I don't know. I think it could be a ton of things. It's not even worth speculating on. It's fun to speculate. That's just not what I do on my channel. This looks like a, it's going to be a great movie. I liked The Force Awakens a lot. I understand that it was a uh, kind of a glorified remake. It was a soft reboot. And I'm and typically I'm against that stuff, but I think Star Wars needed it. It worked really well. Fans are on board. Introduced a lot of new likable characters. Ray, Finn, Poe, they're all fantastic. Uh, brought in some of the old memorable ones. Gave some nice send-offs. Um, yeah, I'm very excited to see where this goes. I'm looking forward to hopefully one or two more trailers that give about just the same amount of substance away. Don't, don't, don't blow your load, Star Wars. All right, we don't, we don't need you to. You're already going to pack the seats. This would actually be enough. I don't need to see anything else. I didn't even need to see this. I don't think anybody does. All right, thanks for watching this pointless reaction video thing.